Okay, so today we're going to be looking at a different topic in financial maths, and that is interest rates. So interest rates come in two forms. You can either have a simple interest rate or a compound interest rate. So if we start with simple interest rate, the um, interest you earn on your investment each year is not reinvested. So the amount of interest you earn each year is going to be fixed. So if we look at this example, there's going to be a £2,000 investment into the bank at a rate of 10% interest and for five years. We can plug all this information into the simple interest formula to work out how much interest is going to be earned over the five years. So we've got the simple interest earned equals the principal value, which is the amount of money that's going to be invested, so we know that's £2,000, times the interest rate as a percentage, which we know is 0.1, and times the time in years, which is 5. We normally assume this is in years unless you're told differently. Times 5, and if we plug that into our calculators, we get a figure of £1,000. So £1,000 pound is generated on top of this £2,000 over the five years, so we'll have £3,000 left in the bank, and we earn £200 fixed interest each year. So, how does compound interest differ? So, we know with compound interest, um, the interest that you earn each year is reinvested, so each year you are going to be earning more interest. So if we put this into practice, we've got the um, equation here, which is the principal value times 1 plus the rate of return to the power of time. So if we use this example again and plug it into the compound interest formula to see how these differ, we've got £2,000, which is the principal value, 1 plus 0.1 to the power of t, which is 5. Plug this into your calculator you should get £3,221.2p, which is the amount you'll have in the bank account after um, the five years is up. So we can see there's a difference between these two of 1221 So you can see that more interest is earned with compound interest as the interest you earn each year is reinvested and then the interest is calculated from this 